Hello friends and welcome to the video. I have been caffeinated and motivated all weekend. Got a lot done on my Hi-Fi build. However, my camera and my laptop have decided to split the sheets, to get divorced, or at the very least, not communicate with each other. And I lost a ton of raw footage. So, we're going to get past that. I wanted to do another beginner laser cut video. I believe this will be number 12. I want to talk about artificial intelligence. Mm, yeah, it's kind of a scary thing. Uh, if it was to get out of hand, everybody has the uh, Terminator theory about that sort of thing. But we're just going to use it to uh, decorate our airplanes. Hey, Siri. Hmm? What is half of one quarter? One divided by two times one over four is 0 0.125. What is that in fractions? 0 0.125 is a fraction is one over eight. Thank you, Siri. Sure thing. So as you can see in this picture here, I've used uh, my own video. Uh, custom laser cut covering what well, i don't even remember the name of it <laughs> it's in it's in the uh in the selection down below but that's just um basically i went and downloaded some uh clip art uh pulled the striping out of it and uh kind of in my own mind put it on there uh yeah it looks all right we're getting there uh, but I wanted something quite a bit more intricate. And so uh, just like using the laser to cut out complicated geometry to build airplanes, I wanted to come up with something original, I guess. But I can't really draw to save my life. And so I went to artificial intelligence and got a little helping hand. I checked that out. It's pretty cool, black and white. If I ever do another one of these, I may just do black with white stripes. But let's get on to this part. This is what I ended up with. And I kind of like, you know, I was looking for something to designate high five. And I could have went with what was uh, right here in the drawing. Which drawing is it? Uh... There we go. I could have went with just that right there and uh, traced that out in uh, light burn and put that on there. And of course, that's still a possibility. But what I thought, I went in, and I'll show you this here in just a second, went into, I believe it was Copilot. You know, there's a whole lot of chat GPT stuff out there that'll draw pictures for you. And told it um, I wanted uh, basically a dragon. I needed it to be a silhouette. I wanted it to be taken off and flying. And uh, put it on a playing card with the number five. I kind of thought, okay, we'll do a high five playing card. Anyway, I worded it several ways and got quite a few pictures. I went ahead and decided to get this one. Now, this artificial intelligence thing, is, sometimes you'll get some really weird stuff. Like, why is there another claw up here all by itself? And, and I told it to do five clubs, and it only got like one or maybe two clubs that actually looked right. Did a Roman numeral over here, which I probably, probably would have kept that, except it cut it off. Um, and I got this weird arrow thing. So its interpretation of what you put in there could be way off out there. Um, but I kind of made do with what I got. And I took it, basically took as much of the detail out as I could because this is going to be getting cut out in the laser. Decided to use the arrows as the high part of the five. So we got a 
high five signal going on here. And if I can get back over, you can see I've went through a few other things that I thought I might try when I decided to go with the artificial intelligence thing. So I can kind of, you know, cut that out with the laser and paste it on the front. And it basically gives, you know, the name of the plane. And I can also blow that up bigger and uh, put it on the wing or something like that. Anyway, I don't know what, uh, what you think about that, but I'm going to go through and show a quick demonstration on the uh, co-pilot part. So it kind of show you what I'm talking about. And of course, I'm going to go to my own uh, website for this. But it showed up over here on my computer. And I'm not even sure <laughs> actually how it got there. But anyway, you click on that. And interestingly, down here at the bottom it says, Ask me anything or type the at sign. So I typed at Lazy Builder RC. And I went ahead and added it to what it said. Uh, Microsoft Copilot describes it like this. And it was interesting how it kind of interpreted what it, the information it could pull off of the Lazy Builder RC <laughs> uh, YouTube page. Uh, I thought it was kind of complimentary. And so, yeah, you could try that with whatever you wanted to. But basically, I put in something to the effect of, uh, let's say, draw a silhouette. It's, oh, and it didn't even correct the silhouette part, so we're liable to get something really wild. And usually it'll pop up and say, yeah, I'll try to create that. Give it a minute. And then it'll give you some hints if you want to, uh, like, add flames, make it a moonlit night scene, change the playing card to an ace, whatever. Oh, <laughs> and these are actually pretty cool. Don't know that I could take that out and uh, put it on, you know, it's, yeah, it's kind of a silhouette. I could get Lightburn to trace the dragon part and, and the fives and whatever. Uh, but it won't be able to do the whole thing, or if it did, it, it wouldn't look that good. Uh, what are our other options? That looks cool. Just print that out on my printer and paste it onto the aircraft and put some clear covering over it. Anyway, lots of stuff that you can try out when it comes to uh, decorating your RC airplane using artificial intelligence. Uh, don't, you know, go try to take it over the world and stuff like that. We don't need no Terminator situation. <laughs> but anyway, hope you enjoyed the video and, uh, Really hope some uh, more of you that are watching actually subscribe. I wish the end.